join us and discover beautiful beaches, rugged landscapes, pretty towns, desolate mountain ranges that sweep down to stunning lakes, unique architecture, history and folklore, no shamrocks, no shillelaghs and definitely no shenanigans, just make it Ireland. We're in Dublin's Grafton Street in front of the famous Bewley's Oriental Cafe. If you look carefully, you can see that the Bewley's sign on the building is pretty spectacular, made in mosaic in Egyptian revival style. Very beautiful. And as I queue for a seat, we can look down the famous Grafton Street. It was good to get in out of the cold, but it still took another while in the queue before I got a seat. As you can see, it's Christmas. The company was founded in Dublin way back in 1840. The family traded in tea and coffee in Dublin from premises in South Great George Street and Westmoreland Street before opening this cafe in 1927. The building was modified extensively in 1995 and refurbished again between 2004 and 2005 and then again between 2015 and 2017. This latter work was described as a multi-million euro refurbishment. These beautiful stained glass windows by Harry Clark are one of the wonders of the original building. It has a certain splendour, but I think these various updates have certainly taken their toll on the soul of the place. There are undoubtedly some fantastic original features in the building and there's an attempt to make the place homely with open fires. But there's unfortunately also a little bit of a clinical feel to the place and while I can't remember the cafe before 1995 and its renovation, I suspect the considerable works that have been undertaken to update the space have resulted in the cafe perhaps losing the very thing that marked it out as unique. If you remember the place prior to its renovation, I'd be interested to hear your view in the comments below. But I still think this is a place worth a visit and I really enjoyed my coffee. And I suppose one of the important things is what you think, and particularly of the coffee and the cakes and the buns. Let me know your view, give the video a like if it's been informative, and don't forget to subscribe, I'd really, really appreciate that. See you in the next video.